Hi viewers, we are back to excited with some good actions. Today is going to be wonderful. Um, we are going to show you on how to, we are going to take it in two segments. The first segment is going to be how to defend multiple punches. Then we go to the next segment on how to counter those punches. So for our first timers, always we would like to remind you, subscribe and hit the bell and leave your comment. Then for our esteemed subscribers, say thank you. So stay tuned today and be excited. Okay, now, as you can see, we went two segments. The first, we were flowing. So I was taking the punches. Now take your punch again, just tap your punch. I was only doing that, stopping the punch. There was no counter. I was only stopping the punches. Now, if you watch this, there was nothing like this. I didn't apply dodging. I was only using direct, direct stopping. Direct stopping. It is not bad if you want to apply dodging, but we are talking about just direct stopping. Then after the direct stopping, now okay, before then, how is it possible for you to take the direct stopping? You have to first of all be good with your defense technique. Now take the point. Now you can see, it doesn't matter how many times it comes, you are already there. <laughs> Direct stopping. Okay? Now, after that, I had to do this. Take it. Now, can you see that? Now I had to stop him. That's how I now apply the counter. So now if if you watch the, the direct, the, 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 the stopping and the counter, there are two different things. The counter allow him, I mean the direct stopping allow him to become, he can't flow. But when I start countering, I restrict him from penetrating. So, if you are able to counter, you are good to go. But first, like I said, your defensive technique or defensive skills has to be intact before the counter. Because the only time you can stand to counter is first of all, you have to be able to stand to defend. Because if you cannot stand and defend, you can stand and counter. Now what makes you to stand to counter is, now what we go, pop, pop, pop. If I'm stepping, I can't counter. But I should be able to stand. Mm. Can I see that? So, your ability to counter is first of all, your skills and the ability to be able to defend not to be afraid of the punch coming but to build up your defensive tech skills to be able to stand the punch stop it stop it and then do your country now let's see another form of counter i've been using the kick counter but let's see another form of counter it goes you can see that okay See that the counter go with the hand immediately I stop the point pa, pa, boom. okay now when if I go the counter you come down this way. I go pa, boom. you see that so even if he comes down here after this counter now try pointing here boom. so you have to be very very alert and sweet so you don't just go for an counter pa, pa, okay. How do you build the defense? Take away fear. Ah, there's a punch. Here, yeah, a punch is coming. Boom. And you start getting afraid. That's a punch. You 
Ah, there's no way you can succeed to defend Douglas of country. All right. So first of all, you have to calm down, relax, train well, learn the possible techniques and steps of how to first of all take away fear of the technique coming. When you take away the fear of the punch coming and you build yourself to be able to stand the punch, then you are good to go. And you are ready for the next step, which you can counter comfortably. You can stop your opponent at any point, any time you feel like. And you can allow him to flow if you wish to. Now you be, it will get to a point that you will be deciding the fight, not the fight deciding for you. That is when you will know what you are doing. So I will leave us here it will come your way next time we have much more of this to show to you this is just one aspect like i said we didn't apply the dodge here because most of us must have known that yeah they are dodging but we are only working on the direct stopping and counter okay so before we will come your way next time to bring you some more actions but today for now we will say thank you but before we go quickly let me drop this any video that you want us to do, maybe the ones we've not done yet, or the ones we've done but you want us to redo, you can drop it, then we'll attend to it. First timers would like to remind you, always subscribe and hit the bell. Then our esteemed subscribers, we say thank you.